All right, so I've been contemplating on this for so long, and I think it's like finally time to do it. Okay, so we all know the situation in Russia and Ukraine. Okay, it's a lot more than that, and this has been going on for a while, but I only got like five minutes. Um, so we know as of Thursday, February 24th. February 24th, Russia has started to invade Ukraine. They started with bombs. Now, for the longest time, America has been telling them for about a month, Russia's going to invade. Russia's going to invade. Russia's going to invade. The fucking president, Zelensky, said, no, we don't want to, you know, make the people upset. We don't want the banks. We don't want the... The, the the economy to go down. We don't want the oligarchs to leave. Oligarchs come back. We don't want this. Everything's normal. Everything's normal. We've been fighting Russia for eight years. Everything's... And now look, your people wasn't prepared. You know what I mean? I mean, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. The Ukrainians probably are prepared. I know America damn sure made sure they would be prepared. But... It's the will, it's the people, as I know for sure, just me alone as an American citizen, if any outside force was to ever come in and try to change anything, I would stand up for my country, I damn sure would, that's my home, that's my living, that's, I would stand up for it, to the best of my ability, not even being in the army, just having a pistol, I would try my best to stand up. But it's a will, you know what I mean? It's the same thing, look at Afghanistan. Taliban didn't take back Afghanistan with a fierce fight. They gave up. Stop using that. You cannot use that. That is so... Bro, you, you can't use that in an argument. Oh, well, Taliban took over again. Taliban always had Afghanistan. America is what was keeping Afghanistan flowing normally but they had to have the will we gave them 20 years of will and they didn't have the will ukraine is gonna have to step up they're not in nato we can't we cannot attack russia we have a pact with russia we have equal uh, we have equal, um, no, we have collateral damage. We have equal collateral damage, something like that. If we do anything to Russia, they have the will to do it right back to us. And it will be our fault. And vice versa. But Russia knows if they were to touch any of the NATO countries, once one NATO country is attacked, all NATO countries are attacked. So, of course, Russia wouldn't do that. But Russia wants to get back the Soviet Union. I mean, what, well, he's been president for 20 years? Oh, I'm sorry. He's been dictator <laughs> for about 11 years. President for eight. We'll just say eight because I, I believe that's what a regular president should be, eight years. If you're voted by your people. But let me tell you what I think in the future. You know, let me say, first of all, fuck Trump. Okay? Um, fuck Trump. Tucker Carson, you little, you, you, you grew up with a fucking golden spoon in your ass, and now you're leading these Republicans straight down to hell. You guys agree with Russia, you're going to pay the consequences of this. This isn't over. You're going to pay the consequences of this. This is going to come back to eat you. And this is what I think is going to happen with Georgia, with, um, what's this, Kemp, bitch ass. Yeah. And Marjorie Taylor, her dumb ass. Yeah. And then you got the freaking DeSantis, the inside out asshole. Yeah. You all pass laws. Everyone pass laws to restrict, to more finally restrict voting. You're going to restrict voting so much that Russia is going to be able to do what they did in 2016. To, in 2024, 
you're gonna, I mean, God forbid, I hope you guys get Trump out of your asshole by the time of 2024. I hope this open your eyes and make you see that he is not for the Republican Party. Let him get his own little KKK party he wants to start. Let him do that over there so later down the road we can abolish that and defeat that, but at least not have Russia pick him and then him give us up to Russia because he's a weak, spineless fucking twat. God bless America.